Welcome back on Dynamod. Today I want to propose you a video about uh, the review about the fax released the 7th January 2021 by the Kesu Shop about the Codex Space Marine. I want to remind you that these are only the updated fax, so the new one released. If you are interested about the previous one, I invite you to go to see in the description the link about the previous video about the fax, because each time I release such video it will be about the new fact updated so that you can have the site about these new ones so if you're interested about the previous one there are yet the video about them so now we can begin the first one that we can find it's about the codex supplement combat to train bonuses and it's a sort of clarifying more than something that changed in fact it said that in each of the codex space marine codex supplements you can find a detachment ability that confer additional bonuses to units with the combat dotings ability while a particular dotings is active for your army and it said that whenever a rule allow a unit to gain a bonus of a particular doctrine, even though it is not active for the rest of your army, for example the adaptive strategy stratagem and so on, then whilst that rule applies to that unit, that unit will also gain the benefit from any such detachment ability. So it's a way that you can add more options about. So it's quite important that has been clarified so you don't have any problem about having the option that you are going to use as strategy and so on added to the one that you should have so it's a really quite interesting as fuck and then we have a fuck about the combat revival stratagem and it's the same as usual it's only excluding an invader atv squad to use this stratagem so that you can't regain the full model about so it's simply a way that you screwed that specific unit. For the rest, it's the same as usual about the apothecary using this stratagem. And then I put some facts together, because we can see an update of points about some units. So we had that the Inceptor's code come from a 6 power rating to a 7 one, so an increase. And the points come from a 40 to a 45. So it's uh, quite important because, uh, okay, about the power rating can be quite influencing, but about the points, I want to remember you that it's each model that has a change. So the final add for the minimum amount of points uh, of that unit, it's 15. So it can gain quite a lot. So you have to pay attention about this, this change because uh, it can mean that uh, the boost that you can create uh, can't be any more balanced because this one so you surpass the limit of your points if you're going to use such one so you had to take note about such changes quite attentively and similar to the inceptor it's for the eradicators code so again the power rating move from 6 to 7 and the number of points move from 40 to 45 again in this case, I don't think that the Eradicator's code is worth of such increase of point as value, but still uh, you have to accept it. Anyway, I think that uh, it's uh, not so important about the Eradicator, even if it's a strong unit, but uh, okay, it's uh, done, but I don't think that uh, it was worth an increase in points anyway. Another point accurate, it's about the Outriders, but these are only about the points and not the power points, that move from 45 to 50 each model. Sincerely, okay, it can be done because they are good and so on. Sincerely, I don't think that it's so worth an upgrade of points for such unit, but still it's a really great unit because I want to remember that these ones can be used the combat revival one eventually about so eventually remember that you can came back one entire bike about such one if there is a apothecary near that can be resurrect one of such models so in that case can be really quite understandable why it has been done such upgrade on points if you are start to combine with other rules that are in the Goddess Prismarine self. 
And the last one of the facts is about the bolt weapon section that change the guardian spear to PG spear. So you have only to remember about such change eventually if you happen to be using this. So what about these facts? I think that uh, they are good. Okay, the change of points has been all and increasing, so it's not a good thing, but uh, okay. What I'm interested about is about the bonuses and uh, the clarifying about uh, the combat revival because the ATV models uh, could be quite interesting in a way to recover with the combat revival and being prevented. Uh, so it changes the way that you approach to such unit. So it can be quite interesting. So you have to remember such one and eventually go to see also the previous facts uh, that can be interesting about. Uh, obviously in the description, the link about. So from Dino Mode, it's everything. I invite you to put a like on this video, to subscribe to the channel, to ring the bell and to comment the vi this video if you are interested in something about this video or you want to suggest me some arguments for other videos. I hope to see you again to the next time.